Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 2162 in Candy Crush Saga as a special dedication to Carmen, who has let me know that they have changed this board considerably. We now have 20 moves to clear out 90 jelly, and of course that's going to be tough because we're burdened by licorice shells and uh, the licorice locks and isolation. The licorice shells operate the same as popcorn. So if you have popcorn on your board, don't worry. We still have to hit them three times and they'll give us color bombs. And color bombs would help wonderfully, especially with these little outside areas. And the UFO would help if we can get to the UFO. We've got to open these things up and make some opportunities for some specials. A stripe is a good one. A raft would be better, but I'll take a stripe right now. Yikes, no good moves. I don't like anything that I have. I'm gonna make this move, which is lower to the ground, so it can encourage cascading. But Carmen, I can see why you're struggling with this board because we have so many bad things in the way, including five colors of, of candy. So it's hard to match things up. And these guys in particular are going to be the hardest. Now I do have a UFO and UFOs will send out wrapped candies, but I have to open this and it's more difficult than opening up the colors because the colors I can match, the candy I can match. This I have to strike with a special in order to get that done. I'm going to blow things up, but I don't know how likely I am to get this cleared. All right, so there's that stripe. Yuck. Well, I got the UFO. Unfortunately, I couldn't even send that UFO off. So I can see that this board, because we have a limited field in the beginning, even though it's not listed as a hard level, it's going to be tricky. We're going to require some luck, but then when luck shows up, we need to make the best moves possible. So instead of racing through the moves, I'm going to slow down and consider each opportunity I have and decide what the best move is. Not just what a move is, but what the best move is. Sometimes we only have one move or sometimes we don't have any and we get a reshuffle. But if I do have a choice, I wanna make the best choice. I'm gonna pause the recording. I'm gonna come back with a new board, but no microphone until there's something important to say. See you in just a bit. Okay, so I got it because even though I can't reach green with this, I can reach blue and I've got this beautiful thing aimed right here. So just a little bit of patience to get this one done for me. It was under 10 tries, but just under. It took me nine attempts to get this one done. Bit of a sticky wicket there trying to maneuver through all of the problems. But once you can get it cleared a little bit, uh, then you've got a lot more space to make a lot more matches and specials and just be really careful to look for the best approaches. Those combos can be extremely helpful. If this was helpful to you folks, I would ask that you consider liking and subscribing. That helps me out in return. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.